What's up, boys and girls? Here we are, binding of Isaac, agony of Isaac, Isaac of binding. So we still got a good bit of people here to finish uh, Mega Satan off with. Blue Baby, Eve, Young. Not gonna talk about him. That's all. We only got three left to go, and we finally get fucking Mega Blast. I've been waiting. I think Blue Baby would be the way to go, cause he's a pretty tough one. Might as well get him out of the way, right? Okay. I finally got the mod in here and they start with the key pieces, so that's, that's good. What the hell is Fanny Pack do? I don't even remember. But uh, we got it on deck. Hopefully we'll run into uh, some Agony of Isaac people. Like bosses. Regular enemies, you know? They'd be nice to run into. But I'm looking forward to seeing some Agony of Isaac bosses. Anyone see my bullets? S sort of doing weird ass movements right now. Like, I lost the heart because that. Uh, was he a champion version? I just couldn't tell. Because he looked the same color as his, you know, regular counterparts. As his non-champion version. Stop spewing out fucking children! You ever hear a birth control asshole? Like, come on now. Don't be doing that. So we got a terrible first item to start with off. Start with off with. Start off with. So this should be great. I see this invisible man. Oh no, I can't see him anymore because he's fucking dead. Oh, I got a pretty fly from a beautiful blue pill. You got two like L-shaped brooms here. That's always weird to see. Pretty fly, you know, this can pretty much let's count that as our uh, room upgrade. Not room upgrade, our item room upgrade. Just gonna ignore the fanny pack. Fanny pack, okay item. Forget what it does, but I'm just gonna say it's an okay item. Something with drops, I think. Filled with goodies, like randomly we'll get what is it, a trinket? It might be a trinket we get randomly. I don't I don't remember. <gasps> Bastard! Bastard! Alright, first boss. One heart. This is gonna look terrible. Oh no! This dude's in here too? Fuck out of here, man! Ah! Ignore it. Is that a liver? Oh, it's a scab. What to buy, what to buy. I can buy Cuba meat. Or I, I'm getting a box of friends. Watch this come in handy. Watch it. All right, V haunt. Let's go. Can I hit him? Oh, he was like unghosted, so it looked like I could hit him. But we are about to do shit. Probably you no, know, actually dodge. But we are about to do some work. What's the pink one do? What the fuck is that? Hell, he just unleashed. Don't do it. Jesus Christ, that's terrifying. Do it again. Okay, it was. Remember when I said do it again? It was, it was a joke, man. You ever hear a joke? You ever hear sarcasm? Don't do it again. Don't do it again. All right, he didn't do it again. It's all good. We live. It's all that matters. Don't give me this shit. I see a little spirit heart in here. I'm down one heart. I'm down two one heart. And I really don't want to restart the run again. I feel like I made some crucial decisions in the succession of this run by picking up box of friends and we need to keep this decision alive what do the green ones do is it just acid okay nothing when they die samson's lock your rage grows is that if i get hit because uh, i don't know how often i'm gonna get hit throughout the rest of this floor it's not gonna be often i'll tell you that i can guarantee you that let's get a super hard ass room then this is that's another thing talk about callus oh my god callus would be Actually, fucking amazing. All right, hold up. If let's do this right. And when I say right, I'm trying to just clear the area from all the other enemies, and then we're gonna. I don't know. Bust is the right word to use here. All right, didn't really work. I wanted to see if we can possibly open up a secret room, but I don't know if I actually landed it or not. D six. You're really fucking hitting me hard with that one. God, yeah, I have to take this D6. There's no reason why I shouldn't take the D6. Damn it. I was creating a whole, like, contingency plan behind the, the front. Oh, my. All right, whatever. There was going to be a whole plan behind it. But I guess now we're taking the D6. Uh, remember that thing? I was like, watch will make it useful. Ignore it. Let's see what we get from this. Maggie's bow? That's not bad at all. 
because it's a health up and now I won't die instantly. <laughs> it's all good. Alright, so we do have a charge for the D6. Yeah, I'll pick it up. And we got one heart left. Chariot left. So as long as we can find a way to use this chariot, like, I have to see the bullet coming. And that's when I will use the chariot. L chariot. So I say chariot in Spanish? Put L on it. Let's go! Go time, bitch! Go time! Look at that. Nice and easy. What did I get? Spear of Destiny. Alright, yeah, that's fun. See, thing is... <laughs> if only I could see them, I can get them. Oh, no. What happens if there was something good there? God damn it. Why? Why must I get that curse on the room with the deal with the devil? It's so fucked up. It's so fucked up. Okay. <gasps> Blessings. The hell kind of fool do you guys think? What the hell? Wow. Good. Good footwork. Bomb bag. Should I take it? No. Yeah, I'll take eternal life. So we still gotta re we gotta reroll that kamikaze, don't we? So I gotta get enough rerolls for that. Maybe I should have just took bomb back. Whatever. This is a terrible room. Who, who made this room? Who made this room? They're the fucking skeletons, dude. Please, let me get through this. Please, step back. Step back. Step back. They just keep coming. They just keep coming. Oh my god, I lost like six hearts here. On this whole entire floor, I lost like six hearts. That was literally... No, I lost another one. What the fuck is wrong with me? That was the worst fucking room I've ever seen. That was so terrible. At least like for this stage in the game, that was so terrible. So many enemies with like zero firepower. Like I do three... I have three... Was it three damage? Whatever the fuck that's called. Three in the damage stat? Like, come on. The fuck was I supposed to do there? This room's way better than the last one. Like, holy shit. I can't, dude. I have so much trouble dodging the skeleton, dude. It's not even funny. At this point, I don't even think I care. Just back the fuck up, dude. Back up. Okay. You die too, asshole. I don't want that. I don't want that. I'll take a guardian angel. I'll, yeah, I'll take it. Look how beautiful we look. Very beautiful. Let's see what's in the second room. <gasps> That's actually really good. I will take me a transcendence. That's a good ass item right there. Oh, look. And I get to use it right away. Yo. <laughs> Did we just get that? That's like my first time getting that in like forever. Alright. Things are looking up again. I remember when I had like no hearts. Now I'm... Got a good bit of hearts. Oh god, I hate this room. Just fucking explode if you're gonna explode, assholes. Jesus. They took their sweet time exploding. Hey, there's an item room. Not an item room. A shop here. And it has something on sale. Now, I don't remember if you reroll something that's on sale. If it'll stay on sale after the reroll. I'm pretty sure it doesn't. But, shop is really far. I'm very lazy to go all the way back up there. But I might have to. Might have to take advantage of it. But we'll, we'll, we're gonna fight the boss first. Oh my god, what's up with these big ass rooms? With all these millions of enemies. Did I really get hit by one of them? Holy shit. I didn't know these guys were part of the Sniper Ghost Warrior gang. <laughs> gang. Alright, who are we fighting? The Stain. Not a hard boss at all. Especially when we can hide behind the poop. Okay, I'm not fighting you. I'll find you with that serious firepower. All right, well, I guess I'm taking a hit from your serious firepower. Because he just went right into the same fucking form. Come on, don't be an asshole. Stop! Stop doing that. I know you do more than this. All right, well, I'm just going to play the hiding game. Let's go, bitch. Oh, here we go. You actually did something. You actually did something besides fire shots at me. Oh, I almost got hit there. Okay, this is looking up. This is looking up. Just keep, keep doing that. Yeah. yeah, keep doing that. Keep doing that. Keep doing that. No, not that. I didn't say keep doing that. Hey. Okay. <laughs> Don't come into this corner. If the other one comes to the corner, I'm gonna be fucking mad. 
All right, we did it. We lost the whole heart. See, I'm good. I don't want that. Yeah, I'm good. Yeah, that's a little bit better. Wait a minute. Come on now. What is this shit? <laughs> okay, hold up. I want him to chase me around. Chase me around. Chase me around. I knew I was going to get hit. We're not going to deal with the devil ever. I have high hopes of us not getting one. Shit. Wait, that worked to perfection. I planned it all along, guys. Uh -oh. Kill him quick. Take a hit while you're at it. Why did I pick that up? Why am I back in here? I think we just won the run. Because I picked up a chaos card. I'm using that on Mega Satan. See, this is... I have to take it. We're blue baby. There's no reason I cannot take it. Fuck, dude. What is all this shit they're hitting me with? Alright, let's do this. Young Monstro 2? Why is my sword purple? What in the hell? It's all good. Purple swords. No problem at all. Hello? Hit him. There you go. Yeah, you just... You do that. Nope. That's not what I wanted you to do. Look! Yes. Hey, hey. How you like that shit? You want another one? Oh, no. That was terrible. Boom! You get a bomb right there just for you, man. Just for you. Fire, fire, fire off the laser right quick. Yeah, you just fire off that laser. Come on, come on. Boom! And it's all over. That was probably the easiest Monstro 2 fight. Wow, look at my face. <laughs> what in the hell is going on here? Alright, Doctor's Remote. Wait, is that Dr. Fetus or was that Doctor's Remote? Or Epic Fetus? I don't remember. That looks just like a regular remote. Alright, you see... I'm not into crafting the mines and shit. I don't... What is this? It's a spacebar item, right? Yeah, okay. So, I'm a... Might be a long thing I have to go I have to go do. But I'm gonna run back to the item room. Get the... Uh, oh, yeah. We can go down. Well, no. Never mind. Because we're, we're, we're trying to reroll. But I'm gonna go back to the item room. Get the dice and then reroll it. Ha! It's fucking heavy. Hell, yeah. Take me a proptosis. No, I'll, no, I'll pick it up anyways. Best friends to the end. That's my boy right there. Bye, bye, my boy. Uh, bursting sack. I love when I burst sacks. What is this? J Joker? Oh no! What the hell? I already picked it up, Cranny. I thought that was a Joker card. I was about to be happy as hell. I was about to be super happy. All right, Proptosis. This is a good item. I've been playing somewhat close up on people. I don't know if that's a good or a bad thing with the build I have going on right now. But uh, we'll say it's both. But yeah, proptosis. Not a bad item whatsoever. It's kind of bad. I also have shrinking shot. So I don't know how much that will help. Time out. Sneaking some shots. Bye bye. Hmm. I'll take it. Alright, it's mom time. Hopefully this doesn't go terrible. I'm going to guess it's not going to. Oh, it's this mom, huh? This actually should just go perfectly fine then. Oh, what the hell that one was delayed. That scared me. Okay, you should be able to go through this. No damage taken. Oh shit, she's actually using an eye. Don't do it again. You get fucked up. You stick out that eye again, you're getting fucked up quick. I'm too scared to get close enough to hit her with a sword. I don't want to get close enough to where I can get hit by her. Just like walking into her. I don't know if you can do that, but like, I'm not going to try. Well, I'll try a little bit here and there, but nothing too crazy. Alright, we did it. Is there one we're missing? No, we're not. Why would I never take that one? Child leash, keep your friends close. This keeps all your like, companions really close, right? Yeah, they all get like, bunched together a little bit. Yeah, I'll take that. That's, that's, that's always good. Sure. Mama Gertie. Oh, no. Not Mama Gertie. Ew. Nasty bitch. <laughs> oh, how did Drive Baby not get hit again there? You got like... Okay, you got hit again there. Definitely got hit again there. Oh, my God. What is happening? Drive Baby putting in the work? That's what's happening. Mama Gertie's like low-key one of my favorite bosses. <laughs> I just like how different she is. Ooh. 
Thank you. All right, so we got a PhD card in here. In the other room, actually got a Perthro room. So, motherfucker, really? I can probably make really good use out of that with the PhD. And I'm definitely going to make a real good use out of it. All right, come on. I have no idea what this does. Holy shit, what are all these rooms? Hell yeah. Give me all of them. Just gotta make sure they ain't cursed eye, because you know, that's where you'd fuck up. Let's do this! It lives boss fight. This should, this should be tremendous. All right, just kill the eyeball. Kill the eyeballs. Kill them quick. All right, how close can I get? Not that close. Oh no, there we go. We can just hide behind a young dried baby. Just hope for the best here. And there is a little spot like, oh yeah, I knew I'd get hit. Cause there was a little spot that I could get hit by. It's all good. We won. Run me a deal. Nothing. Give me, the, give me the heart at least. Thank you. I actually got it. All right, might as well since we are on this floor, I've been cutting out most of the floors. But let's talk about a nice uh, story I have. So I was trying to buy a DX Racer. And little did I know, DX Racer ships with probably the best shipping company ever. Sarcastic. I'm being sarcastic. FedEx. Greatest company ever. So I tried to buy a DX Racer. Now let's start. I bought it from Newegg, but the shipper, or the company from Newegg that I bought it from, like the ones that are selling the chairs, New Edge US, which they handle a lot of uh, a lot of selling of DX racers on multiple websites, not only Newegg, but it's on Amazon too. So I ordered a chair from there, like 200 some dollars, and I was like, "Yep, I want this chair. This is the one I want. It's nice and nice and comfy, tall." long but yeah I ordered that one and let's start with the first problem that went that went wrong uh, FedEx apparently sent my uh, package to Santa Barbara California now that's if you guys don't know where that is or where I live that's five hours away from where I live but it went there someone got a free chair over there cuz it said it got signed off by someone so good for you, good on you. You got a, you got a free chair, and there's the first problem. So that was that was like, what five? Not five days, but like three days. Yeah, three days of me waiting for that to see what was going on. So I never got that one. Now let's move on to the other one. So I told him like, hey, you guys completely fucked up. But how did you send it over there? I don't live anywhere near there. And they're like, oh, our bad. Yeah, we'll send you another one. I'm like, all right, it's all good. So waited about uh, another three days. So it's about six days total now, six or five days total. And I was like, all right, yeah, it should be here coming today. So then I went home and uh, apparently, you know, by the end of the day delivery means they can deliver it whenever because it's by the end of the day. It doesn't say at the end of the day. So that's always good. So they delivered the first time, the first try they delivered at like fucking like 12 on a Monday. Like who does that? Assholes. That's who does that. But I was like, okay, yeah, sure. I guess you can, I guess it was my fault. I missed that one. I was, you know, at school, but yeah, my fault. I missed that one. So then, you know, the next day, well, they leave the, you know, the note, like uh, delivery companies leave when you aren't home. This needs a signature, by the way. So it needs a signature. And I wasn't home. So then, you know, they were like, all right, yeah, we'll leave the note for you. So I left the note, I read it. I'm like, all right, let's just come tomorrow. I'll definitely be here tomorrow. So that or my mom will be home. Can I open this? Okay, it was not worth opening. Uh, hold on, let me think real quick here what I need to do. Why did I pick that up? Now I'm just slow, just for the hell of it. So there's that. Next day, I'm ready. I was ready the next day. They didn't show up. But on the tracking number, it said they showed up. They never showed up at all. And I'm like, all right, maybe they came through. We were a little bit late by like a second. So then the next day, we, I, we, me and my mom were both home. We had the door wide open. We were ready for them to come in. Nothing. Nothing at all. 
But then I look at the tracking number, it said they swung by. I was like, hold up, what's going on here? You guys didn't do anything. So then we hit up FedEx, I email a person from Newegg, and we also call FedEx customer service, and we tell them, uh, hey, you gotta come through this door and knock on this door of my apartment. And they're like, all right, yeah, we'll make sure the driver does exactly that. And then we also ask for a time frame so we knew exactly when they'd be coming. And they gave us a time frame. I'm like, all right, this got it. There's no possible way I can miss out on it. So then the next day, this is like a whole entire, there's like seven days now, waiting for this thing that was supposed to come in like three days. And I'm like, all right, there's no way we can miss out on it. They gave us a time frame. And so the time frame was 2.55 to 4.45. 2.55 to 4.45. So I'm waiting, it's like 2.55, then a couple of minutes pass, I don't hear anything outside, and I'm waiting for a knock, because we told him to knock, and you know, Newegg said they would give him the, give him the, uh, the instructions, and then the customer service of FedEx also said they would give him the instructions. So it turns out, dude came at 2.56, <laughs> came at 2.56, didn't get out of his car to knock, First off, didn't get out of his car to knock. They didn't leave a note. They only left the note the first time they actually delivered here. And they're supposed to leave a note every time they miss a delivery or someone isn't there to, you know, sign off for the delivery. So they, FedEx was straight up just jipping us the whole time. He wouldn't get out of a car. It's a 60 pound package. Like, yeah, you're not going to bring that up, up some stairs every time to my apartment. But all you need to do is get out of your fucking car and knock on a door. It's like 10 stairs you go up and then boom, there's our door right there, knock on it. So I don't know what the hell is going on with FedEx. I'm never shipping with them again. I'm not buying a DX Racer because of that. Sadly, I'm just, it's all about UPS gang, on track gang, DHL gang. Anyone that isn't FedEx is all chill. Fuck FedEx, dude. UPS gang all day. So let's see what we get from all these chests. Hopefully amazing shit. But there's my unfortunate FedEx story. Fuck FedEx. Like, no, seriously, fuck them. So I need to look up really quickly how this will work. And I'm saying that, like, how this will work. How we will throw the Chaos card at him. Is it in his first form, his second form? I don't know. All right, so we do got to get him to the second phase. Shouldn't be a problem at all. Look at that. We already got invincibility right off the bat. Fuck with me, boy. Come on, Satan. Where's it at, Satan? Oh, look, he already, like, gave up. He already gave up. He, know, he knew it was over. Look how easier this is going to be. Like, we don't, we're not rocking a lot of damage. But we're rocking non-cursed eye. So that's where everything is going right. Right. So we, we're going to be fine. We're going to be fucking fine. Hey, how are you doing? I'm killing this guy first. This dude needs to die first. Okay, I knew I was going to get hit by one of those. It's all good. It is all good. What are you doing over there in the corner? <laughs> My boy is like hugging Satan's Mega Satan's warm hands. Are his hands warm? They probably are, to be honest. I can probably I probably could have told you that without even asking. Me. But let's see if I can just like stab his hand repeatedly. Okay, get those in there. You fucking hit my bomb. Piece of shit. Hey, hey, chill, hey! Chill out, man. Oh, I'm flying. No, you still get hit by those, even if you're flying. What the hell? I didn't know that. Kill this man, quick. If we get a good light beam on this guy, like it's over. What is this man supposed to do? Holy shit, he's taking forever. <laughs> Here we go. Invincibility frames. Invincibility frames. Let's go. Every 40 seconds, my uh, empty vessel is supposed to activate. Give me that like black circle. I'm pretty sure that's how it's supposed to go. Uh, does not feel like it. Just keeps on activating when I get hit. When I activate the most. Hey, what are you doing over there? He's just growing his hand back. Scared me. What the hell? What the hell was that? You just gonna hit me? Just gonna spawn on me? That's so fucked up. Alright, I gotta kill this guy first. I need to stop getting hit. Get him into second form already. I'm tired of this. Yeah, you need to die. 
I mean, we don't need to have like a million health once we get them to the second point. We just need health. We just need enough health. And we have more than enough health right now. I'll tell you that. Oh shit, I didn't even know we were getting hit there. Okay. You wanna go into your second form now? Ah! You a piece of shit, you know that? You a piece of shit. Yeah. Yeah, second form? It's over. We did it, guys. We did it as Blue Baby. Can you believe it? Now let me make sure my, my body is facing him. It's all over. It's all over. Chaos card for the win. Chaos card, what did we get? Blue. Wow, I never would have guessed that one. 